Each of those dogs has a different job. Those sprint dogs that you saw down at the fur rendezvous, those dogs go as fast as they can go for 16 miles. Most of the time when people are thinking Husky, they're thinking the big freighting Malamute or the Siberian Huskies, which are AKC breeds. For true competitive uh, speed mushing, technically uh, it's they breed the uh, fast running dog to fast running dog. And it was kind of been an evolution actually back in the 60s, 70s. There, um, there was a little Saluki in there, a little Irish Setter, um, lots of breeds. And that was actually called the Aurora Husky for a while. When Eggle Ellis came in the late 80s from uh, Europe, he brought with him what they call the Euro Hound. What it did is it brought in a lot shorter coats, it brought in a little longer leg, a little bigger dog on there, and uh, basically the year he came he won the world championship, so now you're seeing a lot more of that bred in, so these dogs look a lot houndier. The dogs at Denali National Park are more of a freighting dog, they're a bigger dog, they're a heavier dog, more Malamute style. Those dogs are hitched up to very long sleds where the rangers will go into the backcountry with those dogs and they might freight equipment into Wonder Lake Cabin or they might freight something out. Those dogs are going to be a lot slower but they will go for a long time. We have more of the traditional style of, of working dog that are more of what you would have seen years ago. These are, we're not crossing anything in like um, any hound or pointer or other things that a lot of the racing mushers are. We're quite a bit slower, um, but we're a lot bigger and they're able to haul more weight and get through deeper snow. A lot of the racing dogs run on a groom trail. These dogs also have a lot of endurance, these Alaskan Huskies. They are built for speed, but they're also built for endurance. They're kind of a combination of both, both types of dogs. They can go a long time at a fairly constant speed, but they do have regular breaks for rest. So the reason they don't use Malamutes and other freighting, big heavy freighting dogs, sled dogs, is because they are slower. So these dogs are kind of a combination.